Okay, I'll put a new one. Let me make the Why did they add Savannah and Barton and let me take this? Y'all, the room hot, y'all. Pay the bills, pay the bills, take the hot box. Sorry, y'all. I'll be right there. Sorry, y'all. No, you okay? I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do my intro. I don't know. I hate that I changed my ID number. I hate that. I was, I was high boots. They let you do it. I'm gagging. No, even I never changed it. It was, yeah. it was numbers. Now, I be could still typing that shit in. Thank y'all. Um, uh, hold on. Um, um, good morning. 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 This is the air about that person. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm worth that work. Uh, hey, I can use my face for it. Run it back. I can't get my Good morning. Good morning. This is the big advice. Good morning. I can't. I just got the regular. I do my regular voice. Good morning, everybody. It's the Alpha Star Princess, the Panama de Acacia. Um, this is the motherfucking SMG production. I hope we have every YouTube channel that's up in here. Because Charlie Mother is here. This is the end of the segment. I clip, I completed my mission. I got my pay, and I completed that she's scary, that she didn't want to come back to fight again. Now her mother's going to tell us how disrespectful he is, and she's going to let us know the life story that they had and why she gave up on her son. But she, I don't know if she gave up on him or what they saying, but that's the narrative. But thank y'all for coming. Season the purse. Season the girl's purse. If you can't season the purse, um, season a motherfucking clut at number seven, Savannah. And I need production, cameras rolling. And we got Empress and Gucci and Trina B. Hey, baby, you ready or are you still busy? Um, um hold on. Let, hold, give me give me a couple more seconds. Hold Do on. You know how to your hand? Do you know how to raise your hand? Right, just raise your hand when you ready or coming. Hello, y'all. Um, Empress. <laughs> Let's start with Empress. Empress, cause thought we all wanna drag it. Empress. So, hey. when, um, so, um, do you think Charlie lied or what happened? Can you Me. give us like a brief description about what happened with when you interviewed Charlie, so we could catch up? So, to be honest, wait. Can you play the song first, the anthem song? Okay, I can play that. Yeah, hold on. To start off the mood, make sure your panel's on scene, not chat. I do that. You go down. I think you have to go if you're on the pan, if you're the host. You go down. I think you have three lines. I think. Chat. Okay. Wait, I had it. I put it's a chat mode. You do it. Yeah, make sure it's a scene. You want song I did or scene? It. Okay, yeah. comments to tell you. All right. So this is the a song sandwich. that was based. That was um, influenced by the fight that Savannah had with Charlie the other day. It's called "You're a Biter, You're a Track Star." Charlie, oh. run home. You're a biter. You mean it yourself? Come on, M. Girl, this is the last show. You fucking up. M, you remember yourself? Yeah. Oh, shit. Sorry. Be not I'm mute. Wait, I'm now start it over. I'm starting it over right now, baby. Charlie, we're home. You're about to, you're a track star. You're headed to the top. Charlie, we're home. You're about to, you're a track star. Your head hit that contract very hard. You try to run from left to right. But that night down, I really can't decide. Ooh, 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 ooh. Why did you do that? On be go live on your platform. You should have stayed in ATL. But now your ass won't be left alone. Oh, 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 oh. I heard Valerie say on her life that she's going to buy some Chuck Taylor. The fan is about that she could finish last night. Now, now, Charlie, I don't know if it's wrong. I don't know if it's right. But, but you're asking to go home. 
Ooh, 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 Charlie. You can't be no biter. But come into a fist fight. You brought this shit on your own ass. You was better off not saying any damn thing. The whole goddamn app. No, Charlie, that banner gonna pull up. You a biter, you a tech star. Oh, your ass ain't gonna get very far. The only way you gonna be able to get out of California is your ass take a flight right now. They going to strap up on your ass. She even bring a loader with your ass. Oh, Charlie, they on your ass. Charlie, get your ass out of Cali. Ooh, 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 ooh. Run away, Charlie, run away right now. Charlie, go home. Charlie, go home. Ooh. Ain't nobody gonna judge you for getting your ass out of Dodge. I ain't gonna judge you, Charlie. That girl whooped the shit out of you. I saw you last night, man on the street while you did fight. You was buying that girl hand instead of swinging. Your legs was dangling and dangling and dangling. You was screaming, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. That lead let me know, Charlie, you smart. Cause when you get your ass whipped, you should call on the guard. Boom, 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 boom. All I'm trying to do, Charlie, I'm just trying to send you a message from over here from Empress Paris Live. I need you to go home, son. Despite everything you done took me through, everything you done said about me and my family, all the shit you done did to everybody on the app, Charlie, my heart is breaking. My heart is breaking. My heart is breaking. You're a Bible. You're a track star, Charlie. I know you're going to run real fast. Fast and forest run. Get your ass home, son. Find the first ticket out of here. Find the first train out of here. Catch a Uber from California, Atlanta. I just need you to get the fuck home, Charlie. You ain't safe, Charlie. You ain't safe, Charlie. You ain't safe, baby. You're a Savannah. Everything. 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 So, Bounty, okay, um, I understood the song, but it was just um, all hey. the voice and all that was giving me a headache. I couldn't even listen to the words. <laughs> yeah, but, but, I'm already fucking here. Uh, uh, I already um, liked um, it. I, I actually liked it. I couldn't even listen to the words. It was a song. I couldn't even listen to the words. I actually Girl, liked uh, it. Hold on, Savannah, but I want to do this one, one, one real quick. I want to do this one, one, one real, real quick. Hold on. Oh, no, not my pussy better than yours. Hold on. Oh, no, not my pussy better than yours. It's not my pussy better than yours. It's the intro. It's the intro. It's the intro to the what? thing, bitch. I'm the original one that found it. Hold on, Gucci. Hold on. Now, Trina B, you said you wasn't going to start with Empress. And Empress said she didn't want to start. Now you want to start. So we're going to, while, while Miss Mother is over here still changing papers and stuff, we're going to put it on you. Camera crew, can y'all stop that footage and add another fucking, um, um, card up in there and get this footage. Thank intro that we liked it. Um, live is Trina B. Your man. Nah. Come on, uh, tell your man like a tell you live. Tell your man like a tell you live. Uh, come on, to the haters in the front. Hey, and big head, little body, big head, little body. That's what we was raised up on, bitch, up over here. Not, uh, pussy better than yours. No, we ain't finna do we we not doing no pussy. My pussy better than yours, bitch. I was up, I wasn't finna finna do that song, bitch. Hold on, bitch. I was gonna do the fucking intro. Share your man like you share your lives. Share the lives like you share your man. Come on, share the lives like you share your man. Share the lives like you share your man. Come on. God, where's your intro? That's the intro, listen. Oh, ouch. Oh, you, 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 but but Trina B, what did y'all say? What did y'all say with Trina B? What did y'all say with Empress? Um, I ain't got no shade with, with Empress. I just don't like her, bitch, because she thinks she's fun. I, I ain't gonna get into that. Go ahead. No, we, because you came up in the star because uh, we have uh, we have one thing to do, and we want it be, be, because I'm just trying to say 
I ain't when a bitch sub subbing. I ain't when bitches subbing. You subbed her. Cause on Crip you subbed her. Because she we we only wanted one song and I was fine with the song. It was cute. I I I, I kiki. But you don't have to throw shade and try to come back with an, another intro and say, hey, you got a headache. Because I didn't get a headache because we was doing something to pass time while the mother is uh, over there making uh, baby bottles, girl. Well, but now I the camera's on you. You didn't want the song, but it, it, it really was irritating. You know, you know how you say stuff, um, too, bitch. If you don't like something, you'll say it too, bitch. We just voice for like that. So, girl. But, girl, but some you, people, but know, some, kind of be, sometimes thing. I sometimes say, sometimes I say I don't like, I don't like what somebody do because I don't like them. Just like I don't, I, I, I don't no, like. No, I don't like the song. I, uh, I don't, I, mean, I, I didn't like it. I'm going to be real. Just like, if, just, yeah, like, cool. just, just like, just like, but so, I, I can say something that I don't like, uh, I don't like them, but I don't like they shit just because I don't like them, but they got some good shit. Just like, I don't like, I don't like. Santana and I don't like her music, but I think she got she's very fab and she got some good shit. Uh, but, but I'm not going to I'm not going to admit it to her because good. bitch, where it, we, we it don't didn't see need the music. Line. It didn't need the music. It didn't need the music. That's what I'm saying. The message was good. You know, the message was good. It just didn't need the music. It didn't, it shouldn't have been no song. She, but but girl, what's your problem with her? Let's get this over with. What's what's up, cuz? We from the opposite to make a show. Get, um, let's get it over with. What's up, cuz? That's what it's going to name. Let's get it over with. What's up, cuz? What's up, cuz? What's up, blood? Whatever you want to be. If you want to be a crib or a blood, uh, bitch, you're going to wear a red and blue that day. And, and you're going to rep your set. Rep your motherfucking uh, it, 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 I'm, I'm gonna respect her and not argue this morning. We trying to get to um K baby in the in the interview, bitch. I'm I'm gonna respect her and not argue with her. She said she don't want to argue with me, so I'm not gonna argue with her this morning. Now go ahead. Amber, did you feel? I just want question. Did you feel like he tried to pick? You know, that's how I always feel, but that's okay. You know, I let him be great. Okay. Mother, you stay over there, change the pepper to make it bother baby uh bottles. I think she's still over there uh changing bottles. Okay, um we're gonna move on. So Empress, what happened that day with Charlie when y'all did the interview? All right, so she said, when she said that, um, Banna, it threw me a little bit because I can't recall doing an interview when he spoke about his mom. She got a yeah. I don't recall doing an interview where Charlie dragged his mom. Did anybody ever see me do an interview where Charlie dragged his mom? Um, K baby, are you ready? Ready. Uh, uh she said she didn't see an interview. She it wasn't an interview. My screen on time brown. What the fuck was that? She said she Hello. didn't do an interview. Yeah. Hey, can hey, y'all hear me? Hey, boy. Yeah, we can hear you. How you doing? Hey, honey. Good. Okay. Yeah, so, you know, I'm not mad. Listen, here's the whole wait, thing. Wait, I'm wait. so we real. Gonna, we, okay. Wait, we're going we're gonna to start it up. Um, um, you. Can you enter the uh, Oh, shit. Is that my cat's here? Oh. Um, uh, we're going to start it up. Can you introduce yourself and tell us who you are? Okay, yes. I'm Kay, baby. I'm uh Charlie's uh birth mother. Uh, um, okay. And um so let's just start this off. So Empress, um you said that he was No, excuse away. me, Savannah. Uh let me let me let me clear the set. Uh I want some motherfucking beans today. So all my supporters come through. Okay. Since I'm a oh, clout yeah. chaser, I want Wait. some beans. M, do your thing, run me up, run me up. Yeah, I am run that up. You a, a house? You you can just ask for some beans. I'll give you some, babe. It's a little confusing, but are you a host? Yes, run me up. But Let's anyway, Imp, I didn't have a problem with you. And um, I, I didn't. Did I say interview? Did I say he did an interview? Um, oh, um, uh, it was. I don't think it was an interview, wait, but I think said, when he was on wait, there with Roy, your memory. You said um, 
he was over there with Royce and uh, Prince and them, mm-hmm. and he did yes. an interview about me, and he lied about everything he did. Okay, yes, yes. So, you know, and, and my thing, I want to say to you, M, parent to parent, it, it, and I wasn't mad because um whatever he did to y'all to make y'all go off on him, um, mm-hmm. you know, I understand hitting below the belt. You know what I mean? I can't tell nobody how to swing, you know, because he lied on me. I'm his own bro. You know what I'm saying? He lied on me. So when I come out here angry, I ain't telling it like it is. Okay? Don't lie on me. He was right. on here. I wasn't. I wasn't mad at you and your um your daughters. I, I you know what I mean? Like I don't even I don't even talk to your uh children. You know what I mean? But I see them right on the app. So I knew it. I knew it, M. I knew it. Eventually, he was going to bite the hell out of y'all. I knew well, it. Can I say this, K-Baby? K-Baby? Yes, So baby. Charlie, yeah. about a year and a half ago, had already cussed me out and read me for no reason, right? So I wasn't mm-hmm. even dealing with your son. What happened was he attached mm-hmm. himself to Royce. And I was, so I wasn't dealing with Charlie at all. But what happened when my kids try to, you know, deal with younger people. So I look at Charlie as a young man, right? That's had some mm-hmm. issues in life. So when they're younger than me and they curse me out, I kind of be like, well, damn, life probably a little bit rough. I can forgive them. Once Roy start bringing him around, I said, okay, let's try this out. So when I att- when he attached himself to Royce, Royce comes with me. Royce brought him along. So I have no other choice but for a mom to make sure he's comfortable while he's with me and mine. So I had to do that. Despite everything he said about me, he dogged me. This was two years ago and I never spoke to your son again, but he was with my daughter. So I had no other choice mm-hmm. to make sure he was safe. When I first met him, he was a little nervous and stuff. I'm like, you with me, you good, relax. And he was okay. Mm-hmm. Now the stuff I said when I called him a motherless child was because after I did that for him, when he talked about me and my kids, that was the only read I had. And no, right. I don't know you, but that was all I had to try to get back. Because honestly, yeah. he never said nothing bad about you. He wanted me to get you and him together to do an interview. He kept begging me. Never. Said, Royce. He said, Royce, talk to my mom. Royce, find my mom. Imp, find my mom. I said, you sure? He said, yes. Wait, so wait, wait. Can I, can, I, can I stop you real quick? When you mm-hmm. said a mother to the trial, how did you know that he didn't have no mother? I mean, well, well, he got his mother, but how did you know that, you know, what, what I'm trying to say? Because he always, he's read his mama on his own, in his own life. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, now go on. So continue. Mm-hmm. Yep. Thank you. So, so that brings me to my point. Excuse me, and that brings me to my point. Uh, case in point. Yeah, people in the comment. Oh, he never did that. I don't know why they think he's an angel. Everybody done heard all the stuff he be talking about me it's a problem when i come back and i rebuttal i'm not i'm not giving nobody no breaks period okay excuse me go ahead now but as a mother to a mother and woman to woman no i don't know you and i apologize if i hurt your feelings but like you said charlie he he rough that's a tough cookie there Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. he raw my feelings didn't get hurt and my feelings ain't hurt i just don't like the fact of you know what I'm saying? A read is a read. And this don't have nothing to do with you, uh, your, your babies, none of that. My, my son that is deceased, y'all, never disrespected me. Never disrespected me, y'all. You see what I'm saying? He gave me the utmost respect. Mm-hmm. Even though I did not raise him. This Negro, he got me messed up. I don't play that shit. And I'll say it time and time again. I don't give a damn that I birthed you, spit you out. Never. That's why you didn't show up to your brother's funeral. Play with me, little boy. Hey, baby. Can you talk- try to contact me. Wait, can you talk- you know, can you interview you talk- with him. I don't like that boy. I will never like him. And I don't want he know not to come around me. This wait, internet wait. shit is this internet shit. Okay, mother. Um, yes. um, can you first start off? So I just want to ask a couple of questions if you don't mind. Can y'all get, can, can, can y'all see that her first? Cause I'm going to ask her a couple of questions cause I want to get to, I want to ask her because that's me as being a part of the LGBT 
And I well, I always had my I always had my parents, but you know I wanted to be grown. So um uh to say this, to say that. So when when did you um uh, what was the reason why you wasn't in Charlie life? I went to prison. Okay. And you went to prison for how long? Uh, I've had 10 years. I did seven in on my 10. And how, how old was Charlie when you went in, in there? He was probably one or two. I thought he was young. So, mm -hmm. oh, so about the time 10, so when you went to jail, you went to jail to um, try to take care of your kid or you were just out there being a hustler? I was a hustler, yes. And I was taking okay. care of my children. So what happened was um, I knew I had to go do this time, right? Mm -hmm. So my cousin, mm -hmm. which I bought my cousin on here to uh, so she could let the world know and debunk his fucking lies. Um, she had, we had power of attorney signs, in the everything. Kids? No, she's not on here. She's an older lady. But anyway, okay. we, we, we wouldn't have the lawyer sign paperwork. You see what I'm saying? So my aunties, which would be his great aunts, they came for money purposes only. That's how they ended up with my children. I, I would have never let my children go with none of them bitches. Right. Never. Wait, so how many children they had of yours? Sure. They had all they had all of them except for these two here, my two boys here. So how many kids you got? Like six? Uh and I have um nine. What well, eight now? Well, you got nine kids, eight kids? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, you still got nine. Child still claimed yeah. that one. Oh well, um, yeah, he's just deceased. Yeah. And where and where did Charlie stay in the in the in the line? He's the he youngest. Don't stand, the he don't stand nowhere. He's the second. So my brother that got uh, my son who is deceased now, he's under um, his brother. And was is, was Charlie um, close to his brother? No, not at all. To none of them? No, not at all. And so when you got out of when you got out of prison, when you tried to go back to him, um, he he didn't want they didn't want to go with you or what happened? No, it's not that they, it's not, no, me and my daughters have relationships. It's just that they're, they're all conniving. They're all habitual liars. They, they're, they, I mean, it's, they are so effed up in the head. It's ridiculous. So I tried and I tried and I tried, but you can only try so much. I'm done trying. I don't give a damn. I put all this shit in the rear view because I'm not going back to prison. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so right. I tried, I did my part and that's it. That's that on that. So the aunt, so the um, your aunt, the auntie took him, and then they what you they what they do just like because sometimes when um kids when people parents go to um uh, prison when they mother get out and um, they still go with like be with their mother and stuff it it like did they tell him that they you wasn't his mother or did he call somebody else mother or what happened? They, you know, they just, they, they lied. They, you know, I mean, you guys can pretty much, you know, you know what the story is behind. I mean, with any, well, okay. they, well, they lied on know. me. They can told me. Can you just, can you just, can you just ask, ask that a question? Cause you know, I, I'm get up. It's, I, I don't, I was just asking my ask them. Can you go <laughs> in All right. So, okay, baby, when you got out, my love, when you were released, did you find it hard to get back on your feet? That's going to be my first question. No, no, not at okay. all. All right. Not so all. what was the events, the chain of events that the state or your family wanted you to do to get the kids back into your possession? It wasn't okay. It was it wasn't like that. Imp. It wasn't it wasn't okay. anything like that. Okay. So when I got out of prison, right? I went over my daughter, my daughter contacted me and she wanted me to come and get her. And so I went to my aunts, one of them, and uh, she, I don't know, her friend was there and she was trying to uh, uh, be cute. So I kicked her ass. I beat that bitch mm. for filth, okay? Because don't play with me. I was already feeling some type of way 
you know what I mean? How y'all came and took my children from my cousin's home, which they were well taken care of, everything. This woman didn't need anything from the state. She solidified, owns a uh, hell of properties, um, had a, a beauty salon for years. She just has money, you know what I mean? So she didn't need anything from the state. Y'all have to understand these three bitches, and I'm talking about my aunties. These bitches came from nothing. They were bum ass bitches. So they found the opportunity to get my children. You see what I'm saying? And my mother helped them do it. Hmm. They got these houses and all this shit that they have now because of my children off my children's back. I never would have let Empress, I would have never let none of them bitches get my children. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. But K-Bay, do you feel as though because you slipped up and you was away that was their opportunity yeah absolutely yeah absolutely right. yeah so, somebody had to do it for hold on and let me address this in a second yes somebody had to do it i took the proper steps for that person to do it for me okay let's understand it y'all have to y'all have to listen pay attention y'all have to know everything was set these dirty bitches came through the back door because this was just my cousin for anybody who knows that was just my cousin these are my mother's sisters so that takes precedence over that's what the judge was looking at you see where i'm coming from empress yeah i hear you but what i want to know sis is what steps were supposed to be taken for you to gain custody back because they took them right and they did all these yes. proper channels to get them what was the the items the line items that you were supposed to do to get get him back get the kids back there was none they when i when i was in prison the judge term, terminated my parental rights because oh. i was in, in, in the penitentiary see see now so that's that's different if the judge terminated your parental rights, that's very different. Yes. All right. So when you got out, you were supposed to go get your daughter and you beat mm -hmm. up one of your sister, your aunts, right? Yes. Did they charge you with that? No, I got up out of there. I smashed and dashed, girl. <laughs> okay. And now after that fight, do you feel as though that is why they kept you away from your kids? no no because they they was coming my daughters yes my daughters yes they were coming they was coming to my house everything yep so that didn't have anything to do with that at all okay so as far as you can remember what was your first encounter with charlie um like the little get togethers when i did decide to show up you know what i mean um before i decided just to put all that in my rear view like i would go over my auntie's houses just to make them they skin ball um so like like little different events and stuff like that and he never he never was disrespectful to me in my face of course you know what i mean so so how old was he then when you started seeing charlie and he was a teen he was what he was um, probably grown, probably, yeah. He was probably grown by then, yeah. I think I want to say 18, could have been 18. It's been so many right. years ago. So you went to prison when he was eight? No, uh-uh, let -uh. me see. He I was one or two one, when I went. So he was, okay. Wait, he was uh, a teen, I, he was a I teenager, did, yeah. If you did 10 years, okay. So after you did the 10 years, you didn't see him eight, eight more? When you thought? Wow. Yeah, I did seven. I had ten years, and I did seven in. And, and okay. so he would he would have been seven. He would have been like eight, nine. So what happened in between? But that? I didn't see him. That's what I'm saying. I did not see him. They would not let me see him. You have to let me let me tell you guys. He, my auntie that raised him, she lives in Georgia. She doesn't live in Missouri. Uh. That's oh, how so you ended up. He's, he, yes, you. yes, M. Yes, 
My, that's why he. That's why he lied. He's not from Georgia. He's not from Atlanta. He was oh. born. He was born in Missouri. My auntie moved to Georgia. That's how, and she was the one who took him in. So that's how he ended up in Georgia. You see what I'm saying? Okay. So I when you get out, not from Georgia. Yeah, he's mm -hmm. not. No. And you didn't try to go to Georgia to get him or nothing or look for like finding she, or. No, she wouldn't let me. I knew where he was. I didn't have to go find anyone, Savannah. I knew where they were. All right. So they wouldn't even let you visit. Right. Okay. All right. All right, so now he's 18. Okay, so he was one when you went to prison. He was seven when you got out. And then you didn't technically meet him face to face until he was 18. Right? Yeah, he was in his teens. Yeah. Don't right. quote me on the exact time, age. So you had no parental rights when he was young because they took that away. They stripped you of that. But now he's a young adult. And now you have mm -hmm. to become face to face with this young man. So what yeah. we're trying to get to is. When did it turn bad? Like, can you, what was the first encounter where you knew this is not going to work with me and my son? Okay, so I'm glad you asked that, so I can. Oh yes, so it it was it was last last July. It was at the picnic. I decided I was going to go uh, to the uh, family uh, picnic Fourth of July. So, um, and my son got killed July fifth. Okay, of last year. So, of course, you know, um, when I pulled up, uh, boy, I went up there, spoke to my cousins, blah, blah, blah. Well, did all that. So, so we're not confused. Uh -huh. Your son died in 2022? Last year. Okay, 2022. Okay. Yeah, because uh, this year is 2023. Yes. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. I'm sorry to interrupt you. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah. So anyway, um, so that all happened. So I seen him July 4th. We took pictures together, me and Charlie, blah, blah, blah. Everything was good. Okay. So me and my daughter, we get into it that they drove down here to my house, blah, blah, blah. Um, so me and her got into it. And I guess she went back and she told uh, Charles, like, like, I don't know for what. So um, he was talking stuff. So my other daughter, she, you know, she was telling, telling uh, me everything. And so I said, well, get him on the horn. So we got him on the horn, blah, blah, blah. So we had words or whatever, blah, blah. And um, then so that's how that all that came about with me and him. So did you guys get in a big, big, nasty fight? We just had words on the phone, honey, because just like he does on on the internet, he's like this in real life. He'll he'll never he'll never show his face. He didn't even come to to my son's funeral because after he talked all that shit and was disrespectful on the phone, yeah, he uh, please he wasn't showing up. Okay, his two brothers, all my cousins, they they would have whooped his ass. It, it, there's no way he was gonna show his face at my son's funeral okay who grew up okay how many kids do you have k baby i have nine eight now and how many grew up with charlie were they all separated or were they all in the same house yes ma'am they uh i have three aunties so they were all split up between the three aunts mm -hmm. who did charlie grow up with with my daughter and i won't say her name with with okay. one daughter of mine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How close was Charlie to his brother? Because Charlie is a baby when you left. Mm -hmm. So that means when he's separated, he's very young. So how close was he to that, the young man that passed? They wasn't close at all because um, my son that's deceased, he was raised with another aunt in, in, in another whole separate household. You see what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Oh, um, they said Charlie wanted a lot of messages is coming in. Is this real? 
That's real or fake? Thank you, Savannah, for having the channel. Everybody come on in. This is Charlie's mom in box two, K-Baby. I know you know Gucci. To Savannah's the host. You know Trina B. Legend Cortez is here. And I'm oh, Trina B. wants to say something. Um, season it, season it. If y'all can't send a gift, season the uh, cat tab number seven, Savannah. K-Baby, um, um, somebody um, um, say check your messages. I need forty one dollars to be at the next year. Period. Thank you, Kia Myers. Thank you, Keisha. Thank you, Nate. Girl, at this point, us gays need the odds to fall. <laughs> girl, at this point, girl. We all just need to fall. Okay, baby, somebody said check your messages real quick. We all just need to fall, Sarah. I guess they about to mess up the interview, Savannah. It's some people telling her to check her messages. I guess they this is too much because I'm talking to her. They about to try to mess. I think they about to mess up the interview. This ain't too much. Hello. They trying to they trying to tell What'd you to take your message. What'd you say, Empress? I didn't hear they you. They trying to check. They trying to have you check your message because somebody just posed. Does anybody know this dude? Who he is? He had thought of my nephew. He was sixteen mm -hmm. years old. He my he my he he my nep my he nephew is now HIV from this counter encountering. Please, anyone info on him? Contact your local law enforcement. Want it? Please share, share, share. Get him off the street. And then they got Charlie Pete. Uh, picture and it's a positive oh, wow. and happy oh, on his shirt. Oh, oh. oh, but somebody and said, then, Check your message, gay baby. Um, check your message. Yeah, I don't know what about, I can't people. read. That's how it say it's a he. It's supposed to say, My nephew check is now inbox. HIV from this encounter. Okay. What's up, he. That's how he wrote it. And then uh -huh. it, it say on his shirt, He positive and happy. Uh uh uh. Hey, uh -uh. okay, baby, can I ask you a question? Sunday. Am I making yeah, you feel uncomfortable, K-Baby? Oh, okay. I'm a, I'm a whole okay. grown-ass woman out here. Okay, Hold on. Who, nah, it's closed on Sunday, son. All right. Love you. Yes. Go ahead, though. Okay. All right. So. Um, Somebody just sent the picture. I'm confused. What did Savannah just say? That's what I just said. That's what, it, it, My whole DM, I got like 50 messages from that. They say he touched a 16 year old little boy. Have you ever heard about that? I don't know. I don't know. They see the funds. Thank feel, you, Boo. I feel so I sad. I need 40 for him. to get to the next I year. Feel sad Number for seven, him. Savannah. Oh, my God. You sound like you know something. I feel sad. I don't know nothing. Uh, you can call his mama and ask that bitch. I don't know nothing. It's sad because my two boys here, huh? Oh, baby, they told two totally different species. Mm -mm. Now, where we got from there? All right, so, okay, baby. All right, so, what, from my understanding, what you just told us was that Charlie grew up in a household only with one of his sisters. So, the other yes. seven other seven babies were split up between two more family members. Okay. Uh -huh. So do, do you yeah. feel as though that's why Charlie didn't go to the funeral because he wasn't, he didn't grow up with his brother and had no connection. No. What do you think the reason is? I don't, I mean, I, cause he knew he was going to get his ass whooped. That's the reason. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, what happened before your son passed? Like, and what happened? What happened with Charlie right before your son passed away? What do you mean? Be more specific. Why was Charlie going to get his ass whipped? 
So if he would have oh, came to he the was, funeral, he was talking shit. He was talking shit, being disrespectful to me on the phone. And his brothers mm -hmm. checked him, and some of my cousins did too, and said, "Now nah, that this ain't how we gonna do this." So he knew he better not have came to that funeral. Mm -hmm. Savannah, I think box number one is taking a nap. Mm -hmm. I think box number one is taking a nap, Savannah. All right. So okay, so K okay, baby. One of yeah. your gripes when you came here was he did not show up to the funeral. Were you upset because wait, he didn't go wait, to his wait, brother? Wait, 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 commercial break, hold on. Uh -uh. Here's the money. Here's, wait, hold on. Can somebody get that? Mm -hmm. Who is that? Okay. Now, uh, what was y'all saying? Check my messages. What? Okay, go out here, bro. Mm -mm. <laughs> okay, so, okay. okay baby. <laughs> yeah, baby. Now, beautiful, do you mind if this is not too sensitive? And sorry for your loss. Do you mind sharing okay. with us what happened with your son? No, I, I don't want to talk about that. Baby. Okay, we'll skip over that. And I'm sorry about that. Yeah. All right. That's so okay. now, all right, all right. So have um, Charlie ever had a, a fight with any other brother or sister? Uh, not that I know of. And what about Charlie's father? Does he have a relationship with his father? No. All right. Did you ever get the opportunity to go to Charlie's graduation or anything like that? No. Who do you think Charlie get his attitude from? I don't know. I would say, uh, I think you, my, my auntie. Okay. Cause from, from the Charlie that we all know, he, he gets close to you and then he bites you like a serpent. That's so my that auntie. Okay. Mm -hmm. They're all fake. I think Trina B has a question. Uh -huh. He's mute. Oh. Oh, another K, baby. Um, I can see some kind of resemblance in him from even listening to you talk. Um, he got some resemblance of you too, um, as well. Because both of y'all, when y'all set strong on something, there's no budging. He ain't gonna budge, and you ain't gonna budge neither. So it seems like both of y'all is like you don't want to fuck with him, and he don't really want to have nothing to do with you. But both of y'all, um, um, got some resemblance. I don't know the auntie that really say. The auntie is 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 certain ways. He might have some of his her ways because he grew up with her, and, and and picked up some of the ways and was raised that way. But I do see some of the resemblance. Uh, both of y'all got is like strong headed, like like yeah. like 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 you ain't you, you ain't for the budge. You could tell that's your not child. Not at all. Not at all. I'm not. Yeah, I could see that. Uh, all right. Do you consider yourself as vindictive? Um, K baby. Um, no. Okay. No, I just don't like being lied on. I always tell the truth. Tell the truth on me, and I respect that. You know what I mean? Don't lie on me. So, some some people in the comments want me to clarify this, K baby, because I've been knowing Charlie and I, I think since twenty, maybe twenty twenty one, twenty twenty, something like that. And when you say that his brother died last year, 4th of July, I just wanted to get the date on that. This is 2023. It could have been, y'all, my, look, I mean, so what? Who cares about the date? Good Lord, y'all tripping on the date. I just went through a traumatic thing. Okay, was it year before last, or was it last year? I'm still mourning. Good Lord. Okay. Damn, y'all tripping over the little shit, man. 
And was all the brothers and sisters, including yourself, at the funeral except Charlie? No. Okay. Do you two want a relationship? Daughter, two of my daughters was there. So you and two of your daughters? Yes. Okay. Do you want a relationship with Charlie? Not at all. Why? What would make you say not at all so quick and so easily like that? Not, not at all. I mean, there. I, I don't. I can't. I can't sum that up for you. It is what it is. Not at all. <laughs> I don't know well, why. I can't be more clear. I don't. I don't. So, I, don't I don't tolerate. I don't tolerate disrespect. Mm -hmm. I don't. I don't. I don't tolerate any of that from no kid. So, and and I, I don't. I don't know. I don't know what else you want. What else you want to get out of me with that? You know, I don't. My question is like, what was that moment of disrespect that you say I'm done with him? You know, we have levels because we're all moms. Our kids yes. will disrespect us and we'll forgive them. You know what I mean? Because I've talked back to my mom too, you know? So um, at, what was that point of no return for you? Or was it just one okay. time? Okay. I, now I'm with you. Okay. The point of no return for me was the day of the phone call. Um, which was the day of my son's uh, funeral uh, when we got into it, when me and Charlie got into it on the phone. And um, he told his sister, um, if I die tomorrow, I don't want her to be, I don't want her to bury me. Mm. So that was the point of no return. And then, mm -mm, who is that? Now, uh, what was y'all saying? Check my messages. What? Okay, God. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay, so, okay. Baby. <laughs> yeah, babe. Now, beautiful. Do you mind if this is not too sensitive? And sorry for your loss. Do you mind sharing with us what happened with your son? No, I, I don't want to talk about that. But. Okay, we'll skip over that. And I'm sorry about that. Yeah. All right. That's so now, all right. So, have um, Charlie ever had a, a fight with any other brother or sister? Uh, not that I know of. And what about Charlie's father? Does he have a relationship with his father? No. All right. Did you ever get the opportunity to go to Charlie's graduation or anything like that? No. Who do you think Charlie get his attitude from? I don't know. I would say, uh, I think you, my, my auntie. Okay. Cause from, from the Charlie that we all know, he, he gets close to you and then he bites you like a serpent. That's so my that auntie. Okay. Mm -hmm. They're all fake. I think Trina B has a question. Uh -huh. He's mute. Oh. Oh, another K, baby. Um, I can see some kind of resemblance in him from even listening to you talk. Um, he got some resemblance of you too, um, as well. Because both of y'all, when y'all set strong on something, there's no budging. He ain't gonna budge, and you ain't gonna budge neither. So it seems like both of y'all is like you don't want to fuck with him, and he don't really want to have nothing to do with you. But both of y'all, um, um, got some resemblance. I don't know the auntie to really say. The auntie is 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 certain ways. He might have some of his her ways because he grew up with her, and 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 picked up some of the ways and was raised that way. But I do see some of the resemblance. Uh, both of y'all got is like strong headed, like like yeah. like 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 you ain't you, you ain't for the budge. You could tell that's your not child. Not at all. Not at all. I'm not. Yeah, I could see that. Uh, all right. Do you consider yourself as vindictive? Um, K-Baby? Um, no. Okay. 
No, I just don't like being lied on. I always tell the truth. Tell the truth on me, and I respect that. You know what I mean? Don't lie on me. So some some people in the comments want me to clarify this, K-Baby, because I've been knowing Charlie and I, I think, since 20, maybe 2021, 2020, something like that. And when you say that his brother died last year, 4th of July, I just wanted to get the date on that. This is 2023. It could have been, y'all, my, look, I mean, so what? Who cares about the day? Good Lord, y'all tripping on the day. I just went through a traumatic thing. Okay, was it year before last, or was it last year? I'm still mourning. Good Lord. Okay. Damn, y'all tripping over the little shit, man. And was all the brothers and sisters, including yourself, at the funeral except Charlie? No. Okay. Do you two want a relationship? My daughter, two of my daughters was there. So you and two of your daughters? Yes. Okay. Do you want a relationship with Charlie? Not at all. Why? What would make you say not at all so quick and so easily like that? Not not at all. I mean, there I, I don't I can't I can't sum that up for you. It is what it is, not at all. <laughs> I don't know well, why I, I can't be more clear. I don't I don't so, I don't tolerate I don't tolerate disrespect. Mm -hmm. I don't I don't I don't tolerate any of that from no kid. So, and and I, I don't I don't know I don't know what else you want what else you want to get out of me with that, you know. I don't. My question is like what was that moment of disrespect that you say I'm done with him? You know, we have levels because we're all moms. Our kids yes. will disrespect us and we'll forgive them. You know what I mean? Because I've talked back to my mom too, you know? So um, at what was that point of no return for you? Or was it just one okay. time? Okay. I, now I'm with you. Okay. The point of no return for me was the day of the phone call, um, which was the day of my son's uh, funeral. Uh, when we got into it, when me and Charlie got into it on the phone. And um, he told his sister um, if I die tomorrow, I don't want her to be, I don't want her to bury me. Hmm. So that was the you point of no know. return. And then where my children were, how did they, cause I, I didn't mess with these people, man. I wasn't even raised with these people. So how did they know? Only the only conclusion we could have came up with was, was with my mother. Cause I talked to her periodically. You see what I'm saying? So maybe, maybe some, some kind of way she got an inclination. So yeah, to this day, we still not even sure okay. how, how they three came into the picture um, of knowing, even knowing who had my children or, or me going to the uh, uh, penitentiary to go do that time. How the hell did they find out? I'm still mind boggled to this day about that. Okay, baby. How was the relationship with your mother? And did you ever consider giving your kids to your mom instead of your cousin? No, absolutely not. My mother didn't even raise me. Okay. Uh -huh. but, uh -huh. but I would never, but I would never in my life disrespect my mother. My mother's Wait. done some things to me. My mother's done uh -huh. some things to me. And, um, but you you couldn't pay me you couldn't pay me no amount of money to disrespect my mother and will ride and fight for mine. Wait, um question. So yeah. um um since you said that you wasn't raised by your mother, did you feel feel that that fell on you to not raise your kids? No, that had nothing to do with it. Because my kids were well taken care of before I went to prison. Okay. Um, oh, hold on. Oh, kidding me. I'm commercial break. This commercial break is brought to you by Charlie and the Angels, by the LGBTQ Gay Pride West Hollywood. Um, thank you guys for me being here. We have Charlie Mother here. This is his mother, his original mother. He has two mothers, but this is the original. Um, I need forty dollars, and I make it to the next quarter. Number seven, Savannah sees in her part two as well. Get her to a thousand. Um, beans on here, she's a house. 
And girl, your picture is viral already. Whatever little shortcuts you got in that profile, baby, it's in the blog. You done made All it to right. the mother. To the... <laughs> Never have it to Bennett. Okay, thank you, uh, Anthony. Thank you, Fatima. Uh, we're going to have some questions, too, y'all. But y'all got to send them on the back end. I don't know. Um, I just want to say this. Um, what I'm saying is, um, what a, a mother or father would say, and that that that, that has kids, and y'all maybe don't like what I got to say because y'all's a lot of haters anyway. One thing I'm saying is trying to get her to have a relationship with her child, regardless to what you bitches in the comments may don't like what I'm saying, or I may be stuttering a little bit. Or however, y'all hate me, bitch. But one thing about it. I'm <laughs> That's um, about to be in church. And somebody keep telling me I'm, I'm, I'm add them. I, I'm 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 add the person in the queue. Or somebody keeps saying add them from the queue. Um, um I, guess, I guess Ashley down there in the queue. She want to come up. I don't know. She keeps telling me to add her. You to add her. Um. Oh. Um, oh. Um, um, yes. Yes. Add name? Ashley. I'll add see Ashley. it. She said she down there in the queue. Thank you, team, my, for my dollar. I, um, I need uh, 38 more dollars, and we'll be at the next quarter. Oh, what's her name? Ashley what? They're trying to read. I don't know what she's saying. Tell her to tell what. what. Tell her to type down there. Miss, that's Miss Shepard. Yeah, Miss Shepard. Miss Shepard, come out. What she got to say? I don't know what she got to say. Add her. She's not in the guild. Well, I, I, I'll say this real quick. Trina and I okay, wrong. I believe that, right? you know, a child living in this world, you know, motherless, even though he has, a, you know, his, his next mom, everybody would like a relationship with their biological mother. That is understandable, absolutely, 100,000%. However, be that as it may, since the relationship is so toxic, would you want to necessarily force the two to get along only for them to go backwards? Um, no, um, no, 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 it's not forcing them. They, at first, all, they don't even have a relationship, um, uh, from, from what I understand. So it's not a force. It's like trying to get them to a, a understanding of, of or, or, or trying to put them in a place that they should be able to. Absolutely. I agree. You know, to get, to get, I agree um, that. Because so many people like brokenness. So, so, so many people like confusion. And this app is full of confusion. They don't want to see nobody love on each other. That's all they want is, is separation. They don't like to see people in a, in a loving space and this, and, 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 and the internet is like that. And uh, it's sad to say that it, it's sad to say they like chaos. They don't like to see a mother and, and, and a son getting along. They don't like to see a father and a son getting along. They don't like to see a father getting along with their grandkids. They don't like that. People do not like that. They don't like that because it's so many of them broken. It's so many of them bro I'm torn. It's so many people, mm -hmm. most of the people that come to the internet and, 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 and come in and all that is broken. Let's be real, Ross. Let's talk about it. Mm -hmm. A lot of these people is broken and, and, and motherless. Yeah. I wouldn't I wouldn't want it. I wouldn't want it for nobody. Honestly, to have a mother, have a father is a beautiful thing in this world. I won't want it for nobody. But you, can on, tell, you can tell a lot of them broken because they go to places where um people disrespect their mamas. They'll go to a live when a person don't disrespect their mama. Five thousand people in the room when you disrespecting your mama. Mm -hmm. You know, talk that's what he did. Mother. That's what he said. You know, that's, that's what he that's told the people. people. I don't understand that. How can y'all sit there and, and, and allow somebody and sit there and watch that? There's no way that I can do that. Uh, um, all that y'all talking about me, but one thing I do, I love Dorothy. I love my mama. I love her from the cradle to the grave, baby. There's no way I'm going to disrespect my mama or allow somebody to disrespect uh, Okay, so bye, y'all. I gotta go. I, I gotta go, y'all. I gotta go. All right, have okay. a good day. All right, baby. Thank you for talking to us. All right, God bless y'all.